Before we get started with today's episode, I did just want to show off the menu when you are here in Sarai's world. Isn't that just... Wow. I am... I am impressed, video game. Let's get going. So we find ourselves in the sky base, ready to take down the catalyst, the perverted machine responsible for corrupting and making all of Sarai's people into these horrible cyborgs. Not, no offense, Sarai. So that, so that the Dweller of Dread could feed on them forever. Also, Rashawn left us, but don't worry, he gave us a puppet. And also, of course, this has joined us. The living glass, the thing that was prophesized to us, oh, just all those episodes ago. So we're gonna try to figure out what we can do here. It looks like we can, I don't know, do some, we can move these platforms, maybe it looks like? Uh, okay, so, oh, I see. All right, and then we can use these to jump across to get up here. What a weird level this whole area is, and I love it. I feel like some people are going to get turned off by this, personally. Like, they're just going to feel like this area is weird. I, I'm a big fan, though, personally, myself. All right, let's go ahead and bring these. I think we bring these all the way down here. And the music's so... Oh, okay, that still goes that way. All right, so we're going to do... We got to line these up here. There we go. Perfect. And then we'll use this one so we can bring it down. Yeah. Oh, I love the music here. It's like, it's like we're, we're like, we're like heroes now, you know? Anyways, we got some new enemies here. Let's beat them up. What do those look like to me? All right, so we got the Yenkes, the Matsakrun Claws, the Matsakrun. All right, we're gonna go ahead and do, let's do a big boost on Zale and then, all right, that only did 44 damage, but that's okay. All right, these guys don't look that hot. We're gonna go ahead and swap to our Rashan puppet and then they're gonna cast Abeyance out here so we can pull in that other one that's hidden by itself. Okay, that did no damage. I feel like I like Rashawn a lot, but I kind of feel like he's not very good. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. One, two. Ah, oh, yeah. Or maybe, you know what it is? You know what it is? It's that everyone else is just really good. You know? It's not that Rashawn's bad. It's just that everybody else is just bonkersly good. All right, let's go ahead and actually use, um, how much health does this thing have? 111? I, do, for some reason, I just don't feel like Arcane Moons will do enough, but I don't know. Let's try it. We have a combo point. It did not do enough. Yink, yank. Oh my God, that was so cool though. Wait a minute. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> Oh, 8, 000, almost 9,000 XP for that. Holy smokes, y'all. We're cruising. Uh, did that... Oh, it changed the... Oh? Oh, okay. That... That, it changed the whole the whole hallway that we had here. All right, obviously we need to fight these lasers. We need to get targeted by those, right? Oh, well, I guess we could use that first. Why not? Now we have a teleporter. Are we? Where are we going right now? <laughs> like I know we're looking for the the catalyst, but are we gonna are we going to space? All right. First things first. We have to destroy this thing. So we're gonna do, unfortunately, it's actually going to, I don't think there's much we can do here. Yeah, it's not enough to kill it. It's gonna use hex shields, which is so annoying. And deleted. 
See, not as much XP from just those two. Just not that much XP. All right, are we gonna use this giant space elevator thing? Okay. I'm a, I'm a, oh, this is, brings us back, oh. All right, so we can use this for free then. We can also make some new things here. We have the gourmet burger, the pan, duar, the yakitori shrimp. Uh, we actually need to make at least one of all of these. So let's go ahead and make a champion's omelet, a yakitori shrimp, a gourmet burger. Oh, that sounds delicious. Don't even show me a delicious burger, please. All right, they didn't show me. Oh, there it is. Oh, Krabby Patty. And we'll also grab a pain dog, which actually is really cool because it, it's nine MP to the whole party, which is really nice. I think the only thing I haven't made is maybe sashimi. So I do have to make that at some point. We just need to catch a little bit more fish and we'll be able to do that. All right, moving on. We're, now we use this space elevator thing. Oh my God, it really is a space aider. Uh, holy, oh my, oh my, oh my. We're literally in. So this is what I thought they meant by sea of stars, not the core of the planet that allowed us portals to other worlds, okay? I expected, this is so cool. We're in like a, a like a space station, like the, the, the space station. <laughs> oh my gosh, I like wanna look around everywhere and be like, okay, where can I go? What, what are, what are the, this, this has been so wild. Gosh, I love this game so much. Use this council. West Wing sustained heavy damage after collision with an asteroid. Area in lockdown for crew safety. Override. Denied. Emergency measures may not be overridden. <laughs> she said, nah, I'm good. Let's keep going. I overrid it. <laughs> I don't know if I want to go to an area that was destroyed by an asteroid, I feel like. Oh, and then... Oh, I like. Oh, this is dope. Oh, this is so cool. I still can't get over all of the animations that they did for Bst. I actually really like Bst. I like using Bst in combat. I just like Bst. I'm hitting you. Fight me. Ah, oh, it's one of those. I can't grab blue it. Ah, well, this is a beautiful time to dash strike if I've ever seen one. Ah, oh, missed the timing. I never missed the timing on that one. All right, they're weak to arcane. So why don't we go ahead and swap to our boy Rashad, but not really Rashad, you know, just puppet Rashad. Doesn't do that much damage, but that's okay. And then power smash. We'll do some AOE to everybody. Boom! All right, and then that should be enough to defeat that. Come on, Rashawn, finish it up. I mean, this, yeah, this is so cool. Oh, we're so close to level it up again. Level 19, y'all. Level 19 is the level cap. 20. We might find out today, friendos. Today. On Sea of Stars. I'd even say right here on Missile Dine Online. What's up? That's me. That's my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on yet another video. Don't don't fall. It'd be real bad if you fell right out. Just just as a heads up, no pressure. So this way leads to nothing. Oh, we made a little, we, oh, I think we had to hit all three. That's what it was doing. Interesting. Right, is that what it did? Maybe, all right. Looks like there's another grappling hook here. 
Ah, it's so scary. I don't like that scary, dude. <laughs> We're in space jumping over stuff. Oh, that's a level up right there if I've ever seen one. All right, I see those chests though. Where do we get those chests? Looks like we can cross over. Oh, I see, we can cross over here. And then boom, baby. We get a spark mesh cape, a rosewood cork for our Rashan puppet, and we can bring the grapple over here. All right, let's go ahead and give him the lovely scented rosewood cork, which actually only increases his attack and not his magic attack, which is too bad. And then we can go ahead and give the puppet the spark mesh cape as well, which Valir actually already has equipped. Maybe we should give it to Sarai. Well, Sarai could actually equip the azure cape as well. Seemingly alive with dreamlike patterns. In this way, uh, increase her defense and stuff. Look at that! I wonder who has our highest stats right now. I'd have to add them up and see, but it kind of looks like potentially Rashan. Yeah, just cur yeah, definitely Rashan. Because Bzzzt has like no magic attacks, uh, no magic at all. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Thank you. Want that there? Can we use? Can we just teleport back? Heck yeah, we can. All right, turret time. Ah, gosh, I hate these enemies. Now we don't have to deal with the drone. And boop. Ah! Done. Level up. Oh my god. That's not a level up. Are you kidding me? There are so many. Okay, fine. We'll use this council. Council. North wing pressure stabilized. Access granted. Yeah, we did that. I guess. This is so cool. Oh, we have, all right, we got some puzzling to do here. What's this, a battery? Okay, I think we need to get the battery into, uh, actually, I don't know. Cause can we move, we can't move these blocks. I think we just need to get the batteries into those, but so can it go? Okay, that can go that way. And then we can do, uh, it looks like these batteries actually have to go to the opposite sides here. So if I do this, I can bring that all the way here. And then, so that one goes there. Uh, is this one stuck? Like, can I not do it? Hang on. Oh. Oh, that's cool. I didn't even notice that that was a thing. We'll do that. Oh, wow. This. Some of these puzzles are a little easy, and I overthink them real hard. <laughs> that one, though, that one was super easy. God, music here is so cool. Oh, we have another save point and a music sheet number seven. All right. We're just going to continue on here. We're not going to worry about saving right now. There's no rest point, so I think this is where we have to go. Yeah! Graplu! All right. This is a level up, okay? Okay, team? Subball. On this one. Ready? Ready? We're gonna delete it. Oh my gosh, I didn't delete it. And I don't even care about its yink yank that it does. Like, it's just not a big deal, especially if it focuses our our soul living glass. Bzzz. And there's the level up. Level 19, y'all. Gonna find out real soon if level two, probably this episode maybe, if we're lucky, if we fight a lot, we'll see. Uh, we're just gonna do I can't believe my magic attack isn't that high. I'm actually, I'm flibbergasted. Uh, let's go ahead and do physical attack, I guess. I've been putting magic, I've been doing magic attack the whole time. See, she doesn't even get the option of anything else now. She doesn't get health or attack right. Just like this is, or MP even. Rashan, what are you getting? What are we doing? Uh, definitely magic attack for Rashan. It's Rashan. Well, okay, it's not Rashan, it's Rashan's puppet, but. And then we'll do. Hmm. For Valir, I could do magic attack for Valir so that she, she's getting two MP on this level up actually. I could take two magic attack 
just to make her nah, let's give her HP. And then this guy is just a huge tail. We're not gonna bother giving a magic attack because that just doesn't feel worth it all. I think I think this dude we just give more health. Come on, boost. Boost. All right, so we just use this then. This is moving. Oh, it's it's yeah, it's bringing in a, a new. Uh, that's so cool that they do that. Gosh, it really does make me want like a Chrono Trigger remake thing. Question pack number eight. I wonder how many more there are. There can't be that many more at this point. this and oh we're going higher dang no big deal just sea of stars stuff so cool all right let's use this oh my god another ele where the heck are we going dude we're going to another planet with just space elevators. Wowzers. Oh, there's a... Oh, this is where... Oh, never mind. This is where we... So the save point's back if we want it. Why don't we just continue on then? We'll use this again, I guess? To go up more. Huh. Yep, third floor, it looks like. But what is. Let's beat up these. We need to beat up the. Uh, well, I'm being targeted by something. Oh, that was weird. I see. All right, let's take both of those. We'll sunball. Oh, which one do we want to... All right, this one's full health, so we'll target this one first. Dolly did. L orb. Ooh, that does some damage. All right, let's beat up this drone. Goodbye, drone. Big boost on Valir, and we'll take down the Matsakron Claw. Matsakron, oh, I get it. I don't get it. Oops. Oh, it moves the whole damn platform, I see. Now we're on the we're on the right right side. It changes. Ah, oh, yeah, lots of enemies. Good XP, baby. All right, Zale. Listen, take that big boost. Some ball right in the middle, okay? Delete that drone. Show that drone who's boss. No hex shields for us. And let's finish it up for a ton of XP. I'm sure. 61, 6,194 XP. We also have a chest we can grab that has plasma daggers. I'm telling you, I am pretty sure Sarai has the most weapons in the entire game. She has so many weapons. Plasma daggers, so sharp they admit, didn't we already have plasma daggers? They admit a faint sound. Wasn't that, didn't we have something? Oh, maybe we could buy them and I just didn't. Maybe that's what it was. All right, there we go. Plasma daggers. That's a lot. Like, look at, so this is how many swords he has, right? One page. This is how many Valir has, one page, for staffs. He barely has any. And then she's like, look at all my daggers. There's so many. All right. 
Oh, now we can go to the left side. All right, let's do it. Give me more enemies so I can see if level 20 is the level cap. Nope, oh, that's the middle room. One more. Enemies. Oh, no enemies. Uh, actually, we get a little camp. What is this? 3D printer vending machine online. It's a merchant. That is, that's amazing. All right, so we already have all those, so we don't have to buy them. That's saved some money. We can get a spark mesh armor, another one for Vale, but I think, uh, Vale, Zale. Uh, another spark mesh cape would be nice for Sarai. Oh, nope, we need to, we need to get enough money to get the surf and turf tataki. For the first time in a long time, I had stuff to sell. Gosh, you love to see it. All right, so we're just gonna buy the recipe for the surf and turf tataki. Garl would have loved to see all of this. Yes, he really would have. Can you imagine if Garl was here for our space exploration? This is the place. Now, if we find the catalyst, Opening the way to the spires was the least I could do. I hope I can prove myself a valuable ally. You can, friend. One of these days, this camp is gonna, it's gonna have some cool info, okay? And let's go. It's gotta be the catalyst. Let's brawl. Over there, it's... The catalyst. Intruders in the command center, engaging combat mode. Oh my gosh! Whoa, whoa! Ready, Zale? You bet. Repeaters? All right, so we have to break these so that we can get through the walls. Whoa, that's so cool. All right, let's uh, let's dash strike these. And we'll have her moon ring. We'll be through wall one, no problem. Yeah! Oh wait, there's more. Okay, I wasn't expecting there to be more. All right, elbow drop on this. Nice. This looks like there's two timing, two timers there. I don't see. I don't know about. Oh, oh! That did a little bit of damage, huh? Like, are we gonna be able to use these boosts with us when we destroy this wall? All right. So it looks like we have. But once you defeat these, they turn into the salvoers. Sunball's not gonna hit anything, so dash strike I think is the way to go here. And then we'll moonerang again, I guess. Doesn't really matter which one we pick, we just gotta get it. Yeah! All right, and then power smash on rep Oh, we have repair units and blasters. All right, I think we use it on these. Nice. All right, we do have three combo points, but we're I think we're gonna wait on those. Destroy those. All right, looks like these are actually not weak to blunt damage stuff. So why don't we go ahead and, uh, I kind of want a lunar shield, but I think we're probably better off just, we'll be able to get MP back. We'll be able to use an item for free. There we 
go. See ya. See ya, second wall. This is a really cool fight. I love traversing in fights in turn-based RPGs. It's just really cool. Oh, whoa. Okay, wait a minute. Now there's a ton of those. Wow. Okay, we're going to need to use... Arcane and solar magic damage that multi hits. So we could use that, right? We could use that. So this way, all of those get defeated. But I have a feeling that it's another one of those fights where we need to destroy the things on the sides, which will then allow us to destroy the, the middle uh, machine here. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna, we're gonna dash strike. Got it. Okay, that resisted a bunch, but that's okay. And then we're gonna use, uh, she's not gonna be able to moon ring, but that's okay. I think what we do here is we actually solstice, solst solstice strike. Well, it doesn't matter because if we solstice strike, they're gonna do, uh, uh, I think we just attack this. Oh, but now there's a repair unit there. What do you mind? Oh my god, one away from defeating it. Really? Okay, it repaired the enemy that doesn't have any damage on it, so... That's okay. Alright, we are... Oh no! All right, we're gonna see if we can use... All right, we're gonna have to use Moonerang here. We'll, Zale will get up. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh my God, every single one of these has a thing underneath it. Are you cereal? That is absurd. We do have an ultimate. We have not seen this yet. I don't, I, I don't think it's worth, I don't think it's worth using. Not yet. Um, all right, here's the deal. We're going to swap to Sarai. She's going to use Venom Flurry. And I know we have, I know we have three combo points, but I want to wait. We also do have an ultimate. Of course, the repair unit, but that's okay, right? Because... Actually, will the repair unit only do... The repair unit might only do... Hmm. Why don't we go ahead and use the Yakatori Shrimp on Valir. We're, we'll wait for Zale to get up, and then she'll use the... Um, I guess the champion's omelet on herself too. She doesn't really need that, but that's okay. We just that's fine. Heal heal the it's it should be full health. I haven't done any damage to it, so. Healed itself. Perfect. There we go. All six have been destroyed. It's going to put new ones, though, so now we can do damage to this thing, the catalyst. So we're going to do... Well, we do have Valir's ultimate. I think we use... We haven't seen... We just haven't seen Bist yet, right? We haven't seen theirs, so I say we use their ultimate on the catalyst. Do we boost it, too? Nah. Let's do it. Altered Bist. My gosh, that was so cool. You do what, dude? Wow. All right, we're gonna boost. Uh, we're gonna boost Sarai here so that she can use the uh, moon shift. 
Yeah, because we know Moonshift does a ton of single target damage. Three hundred and six damage. All right, and then our boy Zale is gonna use. Come on, bud. 149. Oh, I see. I knew it. Oh, wait. Oh, no. It does have that many salvoers. Jeez, dude. All right. We want a moon ring. Do we want a moon ring? Yeah, we want a moon ring. All right. And then, oh my gosh. Wait, there's so many. There's so many of the repair units. No, that is not good. All right, let's swap to... Oh gosh, we don't really have too many options here. We can maybe use Arcane Moons here with this and just hope that it... All right, well, we were able to destroy at least one. It's only 85. Here we go. All right, so we don't have Moonshiv combo-wise. But that's okay. What we do have is two boost that we can use for Solstice Strike. Uh, yeah. Oh, we won! Oh, we did it! 16,454 XP. Woo! All right, that fight didn't go that bad, actually. I thought that was going to be a lot harder when I saw that there was that many consoles, consoles that you had to destroy that many times. Sarai, are you okay? the girl with pigtails her i remember now soul curator huh what happened it doesn't matter let's check the control module this has to be what's creating the clouds but i've never seen anything so intricate cedric tell me you've got something skin yeah. Negative. Negative. Encryption, Encryption level too high. high. <sighs> I can't use this. Bist. Apologies, Sarai. My people were builders and magicians. The wonders of technology are a mystery to me. We were so close. I beg your pardon. A word, if I may. Hey, look over there. The catalyst is still alive. Please, one moment. I am not evil. I was forced to operate within the catalyst against my will. And I must say, I had quite an awful time of it. Can you help stop the clouds? Believe me, I wish I could, but alas, the only function I have access to is the one used to attach souls to machines. Hmm. My databank does contain plenty of schematics related to Skybase, however. Can you give them to us? I'm afraid everything is encrypted. Access is virtually impossible. Oh yeah? I wonder if I just... It worked? Hmm. hmm. So just a bunch of documentation and intricate designs. There's nothing in here about operating the console directly. Teeks, you're amazing. Tech-savvy engineers may infer core function based on blueprints and schematics. 
Recommended action. Find someone smarter. <laughs> okay. Hey, how about Kyle and his friends at the Clockwork Castle? They're pretty good at this kind of stuff, right? Worth a shot. It's a lead. Maybe they can hack into the AI core, too. You're coming with us. Please be gentle. Okay, time to return to our homeworld for a bit. What? The entrance to the Sea of Stars is to the southeast of the Sacrosanct Spires. There's a speedball station close to it, too. Let us make haste. All right. What? So the AI core was stuck. What about the Soul Curator, though? So it looked like the Soul Curator is the one that actually was responsible for doing all of that. That fight was so cool, y'all. What an amazing... That was awesome. I really enjoyed that, actually. That was... That was, like, one of my... One of my favorite fights so far. That was tense. I liked... I really liked the bird fight that we did last episode. I think it was last episode as well. Well, I guess all we can do is leave this space station. Well... Whoop. Teleporter works. How we do it? Yeah, let's use this real quick. And let's go. We're out. Boogie. Oh, it's a speedball right here. Look at that. Is there anything this way? Or does this just lead to a place where we've already... Oh. Okay, it leads back here. Wait, do we use the... Oh, I just... Maybe this is... Is this where we came in? Oh, we can choose... All right. Well, I guess we're just going to choose the Sea of Stars entrance. We'll be back, I'm sure. All right. Let's grab this and we get another data strip. That's our third one, I believe. We also have a save point. We'll worry about that later whatever that is oh god what is this it reminds me of something oh so cool all right oh this is oh yeah okay i remember seeing this when we were on the vespertine it looks like we can actually just go directly here back to Travel to Homeworld? Yes. That easily, huh? Oh, we also need to see if we can talk to the watchmaker for the wheels table that the one of the people wanted in Sarai's world. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this. Need to progress further for still. For still pond. Need to progress further. There's still a bunch of stuff that we just haven't been able to go to yet, which is a little shocking. All right, looks like we're going to Mesa Island. Hi, Kukar. Where, of course, we can... Well, actually, don't forget, we do have this shortcut here, so we don't have to go all the way through. We can go right to Clockwork Castle. You'll love to see that. I wonder if there's anything else we should do. I feel like we should do this first and see if we unlock anything else before doing... Like, we haven't really unlocked anything that would allow for back travel or uh, backtracking yet. You know what I mean? Hello, Clockwork Castle. You're cool. You're a cool place. Really like this. Really like it. Oh, yeah. Let's grab the garden stuff, though. I guess if you needed this, you could, like, leave, come back. It's not that hard to get here, and this is a lot of free food. The garden's here. Oh, gosh, I love the Clockwork Castle. That episode was great. Work, work. Nothing. I was I was checking. Maybe they had something new, you know. Hello there. Hi, Hammer. Hey, it's good to see you. Yeah, you too. What are you doing? How's it going? Hi, Spike. Can we go? Yeah, we can't go that way. We could go to the watchmaker, but let's go ahead and talk with Kyle first. Hey, how have you been? My condolences, by the way. If leaving the castle wasn't a death sentence for us, we would have attended the ceremony. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Oh, they know. They even they even they loved Garl. 
We need your help, Kael. Sure, what's the situation? It's a long story. Something about a machine. Oh, I love stories. Machines too, in fact. Let's hear it. Back in Sarai's world. Oh yeah, by the way, we've been to Sarai's world. No big deal, kid. Kiddo. And reconnecting the sun and moon is our only chance of taking down the Dweller of Dread. I see. So that's why we had to make so many condensers. The Catalyst Colonel. Ugh, never thought I'd get to see it for myself. I beg your pardon, but that's AI Core. I have no voluntary ties to the Catalyst. We understand you can't leave this castle, but we were hoping you could find some way to help. There's always a way, but we will need some time. Oh, and I'll need the lore grim grimoire too. Hmm, just rip out the pages you need. I can't risk being unable to record something while you work. We'll get started right away. Can you give us a few days? Whatever you need. We can take this opportunity to visit some old friends. Run along then. We'll be ready when you return. Oh. Gather around, everyone. We have a lot on our plate. Wait, are they... Is this going to be like a time for backtracking, or are they just... And here. Access granted. It worked. Good job, Kyle. Ha! And now we have access to the top secret catalyst blueprints, too. Extract everything. On it. Please be gentle. Oh. So this is the warrior cook's resting place. Yes. He always loved this tree. He once made some very tasty jam using its sap. Garl always made sure to prepare something for us. He sounds like a good friend. The best. I just, I still like, I'm still, uh, maybe it's my uh, denial here, but I still just refuse to think Garl's, they're gonna keep him dead. Like, I just, come on, man, don't do it. So you're saying your only function was attaching souls to machines? Everything was automated. I never understood why I had to be made sentient. The whole thing was quite unsettling. Just another cruel joke. Well, you're free now. Might be time for a fresh start. Oh, this idea is truly pleasing. You were right. Everything combined to the missing pieces we were looking for. Great. Let's start building double time. What are they? What are they? Do, what are they? What are they? What is their plan here? Oh, look at the Mirth Garden. I need all that stuff. I can't believe my eyes. I wish I had conversed with Rashan a bit more. His understanding of alchemy is unprecedented. Does it hurt when you get hit? Not in a physical way. It tugs at my mind, but my resolve is absolute. Most interesting. I should put in a word for you. A word? After this journey is over, you may find yourself in search of meaning. Should that time come, seek the Elder Mist. The Elder Mist? Oh, I wonder if the Elder Mist is also... A, like a soul... A similar to Bzzzt, but without form. It should only take a few seconds anyway, right? Oh, I am not too sure that this is a good idea. Come on! It's for a good cause for once. Hmm. You've seen the instructions too. There's no way they'll be able to reprogram Skybase on their own. They can't do it. You know this is the only way. You can do this one thing for us, and I promise we'll give you a new form. Come on, want to save a world together? I... I suppose so. All right! Plus, our design's pretty slick. You'll see. Load it up! On it. I love that they went to, like, we were able to go to Mirth and stuff. Good morning. 
Sleep is so much better here in Mirth. It's been a couple of days. Kyle should be done by now. Right, let's go check on him. Poor Sarai. And Rashawn, dude, like, just left us with a puppet. Oh, we're in Marth! <gasps> oh my gosh. I don't know what to think about Garl's death. I... I just... Yeah, I know. Garl always took the time to answer all of my questions. He was really nice. He was really nice, wasn't he? I miss Garl. Me too, kid. Me too. That poor Garl was way too young to die. I know. He was. I just... I refuse to think he's actually dead, okay? Anyways, we can grab some, we can, yeah, let's, this is, this is my harvest. I found your town. I take your stuff. It's what Garl would want. I'm going to cook with it. Okay, I might, I might sell it, but I'll probably cook with it. Okay, I think I, I think I raided this enough. What's this guy doing hiding over here? Elder Moraine's house is all done. Oh yeah, it's that guy. Moraine say anything else now? I should have said it out loud before, but... I'm really proud of you two. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this town elder thing. All right, Moraine. Kind of stinks that Moraine's story just kind of ended, you know? Garl really came up with the perfect name for Mirth. The air is so good here. M Murph. You with the baby. I'm so saddened. Me too, I know. Elder Moraine is very wise, but he seems to be carrying a lot of grief. I hope Mirth can bring peace. And we still have the this person that's still... Are we bringing, beginning uh, construction on the spa soon? Bob just needs building... I definitely have not seen building plans for a spa. Uh, which is... You know, a little bit of a problem. See, I just want to check. I don't think that they have new stuff. Yeah, they don't. Which is rude. <laughs> Why can't you have new stuff for me? Or at least, like... We have to go all the way to Jakari Village to turn in our stuff. Uh, oh, well, we did not buy music sheet. We'll buy that now. I guess I didn't buy that before. Probably because it was in Mirth and it didn't seem pressing. We do still need an inn, though. I can grab his fish real quick. Because uh, we did find all the fish, so actually we can turn... We can see what he says now. Hey there, did you go fishing lately? Yep. Hey, you caught 23 different species. That means I got something for you. And we get the flimsy hammer. Impressive, you caught them all. You're a true fisherman now. Okay, what is that? What does the do? What does that do? Flimsy? Flimsy hammer. It's very flimsy. Sir. Sir, what is that for? We do still need to find an innkeeper, though. All right, I think we can leave Mirth, though. I don't think there's anything else we can do here. We got Kyle's message. I'll take you there directly whenever you're ready. I'm ready. Oh, cool. They're not making us, like, cool. Perfect. Well, this is it. I'm ready. Oh, you're ready? We're not missing out on that. But we only have the one unit. So we combine. Easy. Wait, what? Combine? We've always been together. No way are we letting you leave on your own. But in there, well, there's plenty of room for all of us. Uh, a shared conscience. That'll do you some good, Kyle. You've always been too serious. Ha! Are you sure? We can't walk it back. You don't think we've been talking? You're not the only one who wants to help the Solstice Warriors. And what if you can't do it on your own? Ha-ha! <laughs> okay, engage primary function. It's time. Wait, are they putting their conscience in the AI core? We can do this. Courage, everyone, together! Oh, they're putting their souls in just like the Catalyst did. Oh, they built a literal... Oh, I see. No flipping way, dude. Kael? They... They built another Catalyst. 
Anyone here? Huh? No, this is so cool. Hey, a little help, please. The release button. We should have put it in here, not on the outside. Major oversight. Not too bad, all things considered. Hey, don't do that. <laughs> Got you. <laughs> I don't see a release button. Oh, is that the big guy? Punch the bot really hard. Oh my gosh. That's better. Vision works perfectly. Smell too. Sorry. <laughs> Kyle? Uh, yes? So you're Kyle? Well, partly. This could become a problem. We should unite. New name? Single name. Single speaker. Kyle should lead. Yeah. Well? Oh, I know! Yes! Agreed. Okay, time for our big introduction. Don't forget the pose at the end. Yes, you have to do the thing. I know, I know. Ah. For long, we have toiled, honing our craft to perfecting our art. Countless wasted days led to a moment where, finally, aboard our own creation, we can be free from this time prison. Together as one, we will live on, our creation serving the good of the people. And also, the kicking of evil butts. I am Retribution. I am the ultimate engineer. I am Genius Incarnate. I am... The Artificer! Wait, so you're all in there? <laughs> ah, that was so cool! Shh, let Kyle do the talking. Long live the Artificer. Nice to meet you, Artificer. That's a good name. Thanks, everyone. Hey, so we only thought you'd review some blueprints for us. Well, one thing led to another and a path to freedom appeared. So we, I mean, I took it. Plus, I must go myself in any case. The task ahead is way too complex for you lot. No offense. I won't be a battle unit anytime soon, but I can't hack Skybase, all right? Just take me there and I will stop the clouds for you. I, w I was like, wait a minute. Are they introducing another party member? Thanks, Artie. <laughs> we got a nickname already. This new life is too good. Hey, don't talk. Oh, my bad. Okay, I'll just do the legs. Dibs on the camera. Hey, we should offer to go before it gets awkward. Right. Sorry about that. Please lead the way. Artificer joins the cargo, and we get the trophy Enter the Artificer. Meet Artie. That is amazing, but wait, we're not done just yet, friends. We have other things we can do here. All right, this is the AI core. I wonder what the next chapter is for me. Yeah, I'm kind of curious too. Maybe it's continue, the story continues in the messenger. I'm really gonna need to play that after doing all this. All right, so we need to go all the way back to the, should probably, we could probably just take the elevator all the way up, right? All right. We remember we need to go see if we can talk to the watchmaker so that we can get a table. The self-deploying wheels table is ready. Just need a buyer now. Oh. Repine, you say. Oh, on another planet? Interesting. 
The self-deploying table is yours for 250. Why do you need money? Buy a wheels table? For that much? We have a deal. Here. And we get the deployable wheels table. I have work to do. What? But. But. <sighs> Fine. All right. Let's leave. Back to the maelstrom. I'm sorry. The Sea of Stars. Yup. Sarai's Worlds. But before we go and use Artie now. I also. I was not expecting that. And I love it. Like. I didn't really think that they would give the. Like. I didn't think about it. I didn't think they'd give the kids this. Uh. You know. This. Resolution to what is really a horrible story for them. You know. I wasn't expecting that. So we'll use the speedball network station to go to Rapine and see what we can do here. There should be quite a bit actually. Well, okay, maybe not quite a bit, but we do have at least the, is it in here? Yeah, let's talk to this guy. Did you do me a favor and ask that watchmaker for your uh, from your world if there's a way to get it? Yeah, we have it. Deployable wheels table, there it is. You're welcome, friend. You're welcome. I see. Well, these rules are simple enough. I'll just take a few moments to analyze all the patterns. Oh, that's cheating. You can't do that, robot man. Okay, I'm a champion now. Want to try me? <laughs> okay, I'm a champion. Want to play some wheels? Let's do it. All right, here we go. Wheels against this this champion that learned the game in two seconds. Uh, we're facing a knight and a archer. I think we're actually going to go with... I think we're going to do the priest and the mage here. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We're actually going to go ahead and put up this bulwark, so at least we have, like, a little bit. Uh, and anytime you're facing a knight, even a little bit of a bulwark is a good thing to have, right? All right, so we'll grab those. Uh, I'm not too worried about the bulwark being enough to stop. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, cool. We'll grab all those. Oh, that is that is a whole lot. I think the mage might actually get a turn right now. Sure does. All right, so it'll break the bulwark, and then we'll attack face for two damage. And hope for some more diamond. Well, nope, but we did get a bulwark. That's great. And their knight's gonna go, completely waste it on the bulwark. Their knight did get promoted though, so we do kind of just want to make sure that we have a bulwark active. Uh, we're actually gonna pop that, and then hope for a... Uh, I really want... Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna hope for a diamond here. Darn. Alright, so the priest is gonna go. We're gonna add some health and we're gonna give, we're gonna put the mage down a notch. So priest support is pretty nice. We're gonna do those right away. Um, and then actually, why don't we, and just hope that we get some squares here. Probably wasn't the best call, but at least this way we can promote the priest. We get a little bit of a bulwark. The archer is gonna hit a bulwark. Ha 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 ha. All right, so I do think the secret to this one is potentially having, um, you know what? Let's see if the mage can get, that's, that's juicy. All right, so we're getting promoted. Their knight is going to be able to attack as well. So their knight's going to attack. We're going to hit the bulwark and then we're hitting face. And then their knight's going to attack all our bulwark and basically waste his turn. But he's now promoted, so he does seven damage to face if he hits face, which we will not allow. Um, all right, so uh, this is tough, actually, because if we do, we don't want this one. We do want that one, but it's okay. Yep, we'll take that. So again, we want that bulwark. Just a little bit of one. 
this is actually this is a little bit harder of a wheels match and uh maybe take because that's enough to have us go the mage will go regardless all right so the archer is gonna go we're gonna destroy the bulwark three to the face they're gonna hit us for four damage We have a bulwark, so we'll be... Okay, this is all going to the priest. Travel, little priest! So we'll be able to heal back up and give the get the mage a little bit closer to going again. And then... Um, yeah, why don't we do that? The priest doesn't go, but it does get promoted. All right, so they did another bulwark, which is too bad because I would love to hit that, but we win. There it is, GG. Their knight is going to waste its attack on our bulwark. There we go, we took down the rapine. Hit me with a bomb. Why did a bomb hit me there? We win. Congratulations, you won. Here's something for you. An assassin figurine. Ah, happy to play champion. But you got a reward for me already. Uh, maybe later. Ah, too bad. All right, so that is all of the, all of the figures we could get for this. So we have the diamond wheel, and the assassin figurine. I think the last wheels match that we have before we can face the watchmaker herself is actually the um, the maybe the innkeeper that we need for the mirth in one, right? And then we can do whoever the champion is in Mirth. Anyway, so we gave Yolanda the things we had there. So we don't have any more music sheets. We do have a lot of the question packs. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We might have, we might have them. One through eight so far. We might have them all. All right, we're not done though. And we're gonna use this to go to the sky, back to the sky base. All right, Artie, save the day. Teleport to where we gotta go. All right, continue on. This, that, uh, man, I see those walls. I'm like, that was such a cool fight. All right, Artie. Kids, let's see what you can do. I see. How about faking this packet? Good thinking, Spike. Now here. Oh, too easy to skip you already. Just try operating a door and we'll know. Oh, there's the other security layer. <laughs> Take more than that to stop us? How about this socket? Bought it. Credentials decrypted. Obvious fakes. Hey, look at that. Oh, yeah, blatant weakness. Simple marshalling job and... We're in! Now, to disengage the cloud emitters. Hey, let's make it rain on the Fleshmancer's castle while we're at it. Ha! <laughs> That'll ruin his day! Take a while for them to fully disperse, but let's make sure the first ray of sun hits just right. And done! Good work, everyone. I can feel my power surging. You did it, Artificer. Ha! I'm the best! Hey, do the thing. Oh, right. Yes, I did it! We finally have a shot. Artie, thank you so much. Hey, don't mention it. It was the right thing to do. Plus, it got us out of our prison. Well said, and well done. Feel strong enough to go after the Dweller of Dread now. How about you, Zale? Oh yeah, time for a cleansing. 
Its layer is by the moon. We can sail close to it and dive down. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Good luck with the dweller. Thank you. I've got more tinkering to do over here. Be safe. That's exactly what we're going to do in the next episode of Sea of Stars. Thank you so much for watching. In the next episode, we're going to defeat the Dweller of Dread. Remember, likes, comments, all of that stuff really helps out. And I'll see you all in the next one. God, this game's good. Never give up, never surrender.